Hey guys, how's everybody doing? Hope everybody's doing well. So I just want to clear something up. Um, I really want to get past this this entire issue that happened with me. But I see a lot of newspapers and media and everyone's got the words like man claims he was kidnapped or apparently he was kidnapped or this or man claims it was all right so and a lot of us saying this is a big conspiracy theory and you know i wasn't kidnapped i'm not even going to entertain those moronic thoughts how else did this happen i had really rough kinky sex i wish I don't mind looking like this after sex. I mean, if, if the girl's into that, I mean, if you're into that, I'm, I'm, I'm into that kind of stuff, you know? How else did this happen? Like, how was it even possible to get bruised and beat this way? Like, does that even make any logical sense? It's unbelievable that no matter what happens, there's always someone out there that is not retarded but straight potato all right please if you're going to report on what happened to me have the dignity to report with respect you understand no one is going to come and do this to themselves for marketing no one is going to come do this to themselves for any other any other reason. All right. I don't need marketing. I'm one of the biggest in the world at what I do. You know. So you got to understand that. All right. So all these media and magazines and newspapers saying claims and this and that. Come on, have some respect. All right, I, you know I, I went through a whole lot of shit, and I'm lucky to be alive. The last thing I need is people to start saying it's a conspiracy. It's a conspiracy theory. It's that he plotted this. You don't plot this kind of shit, man. You don't. You know this. 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 This shit's the real world. It's the real life. You know this is. A, this is. Stuff like this happens in the real world, you know? And and I'm just blessed that I'm alive. I'm blessed that I'm able to go and see my family. I'm blessed that, you know, somebody uh, somebody above me was watching over me, right? And uh, I was back to work last night. I was back marking modules, releasing a module. I'm back to work already. I've been back to work already. All right. Um, I know there's going to be a lot of people that are going to take advantage of this situation and make uh, wild accusations and claims that this had something to do with CTM. I can assure you 110% it didn't because it didn't. Just leave it at that. You know? Because um, I... I there's nothing, there is no issue with me and anyone at CTM. Alright? For the record, just to clear some air as well, the last couple months, I've personally been in contact with individuals from CTM. Alright? So, it has nothing to do with CTM whatsoever. Whatsoever. At all. Um, this was completely unrelated. Um, I'm just going to leave it at that. And I just don't want anyone taking advantage of this situation. And because uh, you guys know Ressa, you guys know she, you know me. Um, I'm that guy that you drop down a well, 100 foot well, made a brick, 
and instead of trying to climb up that well and get out, I start taking the bricks out of the walls around that well and I start creating steps. And I make those steps so high that I not only get out of the well, but I get a hundred feet above it. And that's one of the reasons I even said I'm thankful to those individuals that did this to me, that did. didn't take it all the way. Which gives me the opportunity to do what I do best and that's take care of my family, be with my family, build my companies, and uh, continue to thrive. Alright? So, those haters out there, you can go and use this to whatever you want and create any conspiracy you want. At the end of the day, a broken, busted, beat up Reza is still a thousand times more powerful, better, smarter, intelligent, and volatile than an amazing you. Understand that. What I went through, none of you haters could have even fucking went through for an hour. Alright? Remember, everything in life is a lesson. You take it as a lesson, you work with it, you adapt, you overcome. It's just another story, just another chapter in my story, that's all it is. Another chapter in my story. Alright? I was back to work yesterday, I'll be back to work today. I'll be back to work doing everything I do on a normal daily basis. And to those that support me, I love you. To those that don't, I still love you. Because without you, I wouldn't be here either. Because I need a little bit of hate in my life. The sweet is never the sweet without the sour. Anyways, much love and blessings. Go enjoy your Sunday with your family. Stay close to them. You never know when you're going to lose them. Very important. Alright? Love you guys. Take care. Phone. I cannot shut off the rod.